LaptopKey.com, your source for replacement keyboard keys. Notice, many times, laptop manufacturers produce keyboards that look the same on the outside, but have different retainer clips underneath the keys. To help you find the correct repair video for your keyboard, we've created a searchable database. Simply go to LaptopKey.com, enter your laptop brand and model number, scroll down to the bottom of the page and click on View Videos. A list of all compatible videos will appear. Select the retainer clip model that matches your keyboard. That's all, you're now ready to repair your laptop keyboard. For this keyboard, we will be showing the removal and reattachment of the J key for standard size keys, Shift for the wide keys, and settings for the top row keys. To remove the standard size keys, insert your tool under the upper right corner and apply gentle upward pressure to separate from the clip and the keycap is removed. To remove the retention clip, support the bottom of the clip with your finger, insert a tool under the upper right corner, apply gentle upward pressure, repeat with the upper left corner, and the clip is removed. To reassemble your clip, we'll begin with the top clip, which has a much wider edge on top and two thin holes at the bottom. For the bottom clip, there are two holes and an outward facing notch on the top edge. Connect the two halves together, ensuring the plastic support arms of the top clip enter the holes of the bottom. Then using metal hooks here, 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 and here, we will lay the clip down top first, making sure those two corners are supported. Lay down flat, push on the bottom, replace our keycap, firm press, and for function. To remove the wide keys, insert your tool under the upper right corner, apply gentle upward pressure, and then continue around the outer edge of the keycap to disconnect from the metal support arms and retention clips. To remove the metal support arms, simply lift from the middle, push one side out, and then push the other direction, repeat other arm and you're done. Then to remove the retention clips, support the bottom of the clip with your finger, insert a tool under the upper right corner, apply gentle upward pressure, continue to the left, and the clip will be removed. To reassemble your clips, we'll begin with the top clip which has a small hole at the top and a larger hole at the bottom. For the bottom clip, there will be two small holes on the top side. Connect the two halves together ensuring the plastic support arms of the top clip enter the holes on the bottom. Then, using metal hooks here, here, and here, we will lay the clip down top first, ensuring it connects to the hooks, press down. We will then replace the metal support arms using holes here, 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 and here with each set of holes being for their respective arm. The top arm will go in the top set of holes. We will lay that down flat, repeat with the bottom arm, lay it down flat as well, place the keycap on top, firm press around the edges and in the center, and we're functional. To remove your top row keys, insert your tool under the upper right corner, apply gentle upward pressure, continue at the bottom if necessary, and the keycap will be removed. To remove the retention clip, support one side of the clip with your finger and insert your tool under the bottom corner of the opposite side, apply gentle upward pressure, and the clip will be removed. To reassemble your clips, We'll begin with the top clip, which has two thin holes at the top and two smaller holes at the bottom. And for the bottom clip, there are two holes and an upward facing notch on the bottom edge. We will then connect the two halves, ensuring the support arms of the top go into the openings on the bottom. Then using metal hooks here, 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 and here, we will lay the clip down bottom first ensuring it connects to the hooks at the bottom, 
press down flat, replace the keycap, firm press, and we're functional. We'll now show you how to remove a laptop key. Simply pull on the edge of the key in a gentle but firm motion. Lift up and remove the key. It's that simple. If your key is loose and not sticking properly to your keyboard, your retainer clips are likely broken. This issue can be fixed by replacing your retainer clips. Replacement laptop keys and retainer clips can be purchased at LaptopKey.com. LaptopKey.com, your source for replacement keyboard keys.